morning guys so new week same bullshit um this morning i woke up super early i watched the new fantastic beasts movie which was interesting you kind of like i feel like they're just trying to like hit as many like the harry potter things that are like known as they could oh let's name drop this character and this character and this and like all these things those kind of things and then i went down to the park because it's a nice day and it's still early and i was writing and i wrote like six more double-sided pages for um my affairs story specifically on walsh and kind of where it connects with the rest of it so i'm like we've gotten to that part of the story so now i'm gonna type that up which i hate typing like love writing it hate typing it up so i'm like it's just annoying but i'm gonna do that now the kitties are so cute. I have the window cracked open so it gets some fresh air in the house and they they want to escape. Okay. I'll check in with you guys later. Hey guys, so it is a bit later. It's like 11.30 right now and I just finished typing up Walsh's part that I had like handwritten this whole time and it ended up being about like 3,000 words or so. So I added that into the combined stories, and the combined story length is 18,453, which that's pretty good. I can very easily get to 20,000 today, which is exciting. And I think I'm going to like work on writing um, Walsh's, like their interactions in the Walsh death, because I don't have that yet. I have Walsh until like he gets to Wilson Hall, which is where he dies. And we get to see Michael as the ghost, and we get all of that. And then I kind of have some of the ending done, but I have not written Emily and Richard at all, which that's like one of the bigger, it's not like the biggest one. It's not my favorite. That's why I haven't written it yet. Um, but yeah, I need to write that. It's exciting. It's coming together. Good morning. <coughs> Good morning guys. It's almost noon now, but like, I, th I think it was like 11.30, I was like, oh, I should go to the grocery store before all the people at lunch end up going. Like, I see them walking now to the, to the grocery store to get lunch. And I was like, I had made it when people were starting to come in. So like when I walked in, no line. When they went to check out, 20 people in line. So like, I caught it before it got really bad because the lines will be forever. But I saw this. Red Bull acai. I didn't even see it was acai. I just saw it was purple. And I'm like, you know, today's a purple kind of day. So I drink this. Going to try and do some more writing. Like I want to have like, coffee is not working and I'm not focusing like I want to. So let's hope this helps. Guys, I'm getting ready to head out. It is Friday now. And I don't honestly know what I've done for the past few days. I have not been able to like focus. Like yesterday I went to the store, I got like a monster on Red Bull. I'm like, maybe the caffeine will help me focus. It did not. Um, so we're gonna go to the bookstore. We're gonna take my laptop. We're gonna see if we can get some writing done because I am tired of, you know, feeling not productive. So we're gonna go do that. One of the kitties wants to come, hello. Hey guys, it is later in the day and I was at the bookstore, I think, for like an hour and a half. But I got over 2,000 words done. I broke 20,000 words, which I'm really happy about. And I kind of did the climax scene. I kind of worked on the ending a bit. I still have one more affair I need to write. So I'm going to see if I'm going to do that today. Like I worked on kind of like how I want that affair to go. It's like my least favorite one. I've been avoiding it but i still need to write it i just hate the character richard and he's supposed to be a horrible person and like character and you're not supposed to like him and so like when you're writing characters that are unlikable you kind of like realize it sucks but he like we need the contrast with him for everybody else in the story but yes going to do that now That, that is depressing. So we're gonna go to the grocery store because today is Saturday and grocery stores are gonna close tomorrow. 
but I like woke up feeling like well rested today, which I'm just like weird. So we're just gonna go with I like I feel like really good this morning, like happy and a good mood. Which <laughs> it's kind of like such a weird thing to like be this happy about, but you know I'm gonna go with it. Like the cats were like chill last night. They didn't wake me up. I didn't like toss and turn. Yeah, and I got to the grocery store, and then I want to clean the house, and then I want to go to the park later, and I want I want to do the right the affair for. Emily and Richard, and I just don't like that one as much, so I've been avoiding it. Yeah, let's go to the grocery store before it gets too busy. Like, here are the tulips that I bought like last week. Look how, I've never seen tulips like open all the way, so I'm just like, this is so pretty. It's so pretty. Hey guys, I'm back from the grocery store. I had some breakfast and I'm watching this like film analysis of Taxi Driver and when I was in DC like on this playlist I was listening to there was like one song from the Taxi Driver um like movie album and I was like this is a really good song and so I ended up listening to like the Taxi Driver soundtrack the whole time I was in DC so now every time like I hear that music I think of DC we have a guest star hi here's a talking with attention but I don't know, it's just really interesting to like hear how, because I've never seen the movie Taxi Driver, which I should probably, watch. I have like a list of movies that I want to watch so long. Do I have the attention for that? I do not. But I'm going to finish up breakfast, finish up this documentary, and then we're just going to do like a quick clean of the house and work on writing. I might write on my laptop, I might go to the park. I feel like the park is good because I can't get as distracted. But we'll see. Hi. Hello. Are you just gonna sit on there? Mm -hmm. The house is clean. I have my keys so I don't forget them in my hand, even though like I know I'm not gonna forget them, but like if they're not in my hand when I walk out the door. I will feel like I'm locked out. I put my sunglasses on. I haven't worn them the whole time I've been here because it's just sunny and it is hot outside and I don't like it. But we're gonna go to the park and we're gonna try and do some writing. So I am back from the park. It's like a beautiful day outside. I was there for like an hour, I think. But I got home, I had a like breakfast burrito for lunch. That's like my favorite thing right now. But at the park, these are my like notes for the story. I wrote, let me see, from here to, let's see. To here so i wrote like this page and all of this which i'm very happy about so it was richard and emily's part and it's like not my favorite part but like as i was writing it i'm like why am i writing this like so good and then i'm like remember he's a terrible person so i was like okay i'm gonna go back to that so they're like morally gray let me see where and there was like this one line that I'm like, whoa, that's so cute. Okay, where is that? Oh, if only each kiss could be a garden, Richard thought. He'd make Emily Eden in this room. I'm like, that's, I don't know. I just really like that line. So, I think it's noon. It's like the noon bells. So I'm gonna type all of this up because typing it up is my least favorite part of actually like writing in like in a notebook but like I am happy went to the park I actually got the story down so now I'm just gonna type it up which is like this is really like interesting because it's like the last story 
that needs to go into like the whole combined story but oh, it's, i'm probably gonna i'm gonna go rework it add some more scenes just to like make it flow some more it doesn't happen so quickly because there are like these four different story four or five different stories going on at the same time i want them to all make sense and not be too rushed so i'm going to do that I think this is the most alone I've ever been at the park before, and it's weird. There's like no one walking or running near me that I can visibly see, which is odd. But I came to the park pretty early today. Took the trash out because I hate doing that. Did some journaling, did some planning. Started reading Heart of Darkness by Joseph Conrad. I don't. I tried reading it before, like five years ago, six years, seven years ago. And I could not get through it, so we'll see how far I get. But I think I'm gonna go home and have some breakfast. Such a pretty day. Guys, so I'm at the, I just went to the aquarium and I'm at like the, it's not the Japanese gardens, but there's like a bunch of gardens like right next to it. It is so beautiful. I'm just like, look at all that green. And there's fountains and flowers and it's like, it's amazing. But the aquarium had like this rainforest exhibit and it made me sad because I'm like, oh, this is just like home. And now I'm a bit homesick for Hawaii. And also Florida, which I haven't like lived in Florida for like 10 years. But yeah, just like seeing like all the fish and the snakes kind of made music. Look at these flowers. But yeah, I think I wanna wanna come back maybe tomorrow and bring my art supplies. It's supposed to rain today and it rained this morning, so we'll see what it's like tomorrow. Well, besties, I wanted rain and it's raining today, which kind of sucks because I did straighten my hair this morning. So, not my best idea. But I think that is an exit. Oh. I'll just get going. I made it to the tram stop and when I was like waiting for the crosswalk, the tram came and went so now I have to wait eight minutes for the next one. You could definitely hear the rain. Definitely. Today feels like a super kind of day. I am not back, it's the next day. I woke up super late, which makes sense because I did not fall asleep until like 2 or 3 in the morning. I just went out sleep. Went back to the park. I already did like one sketch of like the fountains and the gardens, but I want to do a little bit of closer shots. There is like the busy part of the park. So I'm going to go find somewhere not so busy where I could sit closer to like the plants and stuff.
just did some more sketching and I stuck to goose shit. And I wore my tent shoes today. I don't like that. I think I'm gonna go to the Rhine. It's the park that's out there. Maybe see, do some journaling, and take the tram back. It's such like a nice day, like it's overcast, but you know, at least it's not raining, and at least it's not too hot. Even though, like last night, I was just like, it was overheating, because I don't know why, but in Europe, they don't put fans in houses. Like, Switzerland never had fans. Like, what is this madness?